no one game it's easy uh, for for us. So Sunderland uh, had yesterday a great win against uh, Blackburn. Uh, they play good, young team. Uh, they work hard. Uh, they stay very tight, close in defense. Uh, okay, all all teams have issues, so. We will analyze that and we we'll try to make our best also there. Yeah, it's been a bit of a whirlwind. Um, obviously, first the the derby win, um, and then obviously the contract comes next. Uh, obviously, it wasn't just a spur of the moment thing. Like he has a contract and it's done. Obviously, I've been in the process, but it was nice to obviously tee the derby win up, signing the contract, and then a big win midweek as well. So yeah, it's been a, a brilliant few days for myself and for the club. Every, every country have different uh, training uh, sessions uh, types. So England, when I came here, so after a few weeks, I learned also a little bit is different. So I have to change a little bit because I was also in a different mentality to train. I know it from Europe, from Germany, from Turkey, how I was uh, trained when I was a player. Here in England is a little bit different. So. I try to uh, keep the balance between between this. Uh, we try to protect our players. Uh, so if one player needs rest, so we have to give him the rest to have 100% of him in the game. Yeah, I've said it before, there's a real feel-good factor and um, you, you speak to different people at the club, even yourself, and there's a more togetherness with everyone, I would say. Um, what that reason is, I would say, obviously, the manager and his staff have came in. They've been brilliant. They've um, they've bought into the club. They've bought in everything and like brought everyone on board. And I think there is a real togetherness of the full club, not just players and staff, just everybody that's involved in the club. And yeah, I think even the lads that maybe aren't playing as much at the minute, they know they're gonna have a big role to play. And um, yeah, everyone's digging in. Like so, it's it's hopefully gonna be an exciting season. That big win. Uh, against uh, Swansea, I said to my players, it will not make any sense when we don't take points on Tuesday. So then we, you fight for nothing. You fight for nothing. So we win. If you lose the game, so we are the same uh, position where we've been before. So that's why it was, for me, it was not only three points. It was was everything for the future, for the next games. Because uh, uh, to believe in yourself, to believe in what we did till now, from start of the season till today, what we did, what the players they did, what uh, uh, step they made. So where we start, where we are right now, uh, not only to believe themselves, also to believe on the teammates. Everything around. Uh, I, I said them, if you believe in this, what we are doing, you will see where you will be with this team. Okay, now it, it's, it's listening like a coach, what you are talking about. Uh, <laughs> what you are talking about, you are, are you a prophet or something like that? <laughs> uh, no, but I managed uh, teams in Turkey, so. Malatya Sport, where I've been, Alanya Sport, where I've been, because these two teams, uh, I can compare a little bit with, with Cardiff. Okay, it's maybe a different uh, leagues, a level. Uh, also, there I said what we can wish. If you believe in this, what we are doing. So at, at the end, with these teams, I got uh, the qualification for Europa League and I played Cup Final. So, so don't take now from this out. So we will go to Europa League or <laughs> to to get uh, uh, promoted immediately. So I wish it. I wish it. But uh, if we believe in something, uh, we can we can we can do it. We can do it. We can do a lot of things. So at the end, if it's happened, uh, I don't know. But at least we know for what we are fighting for.